None of this has ever been attempted before. Flying a helicopter takes a lot of skill. To put someone like Tom into a situation like this is almost impossible to imagine. He came to me and he said, we're going to go to Airbus and we're going to learn how to fly a helicopter and be a 2,000 hour pilot in a very short period of time. It takes something like three months of eight hour days just to become a novice helicopter pilot. Tom needed to work around the clock to reach the level of skill the sequence needs. There are very few students that have his level of dedication and focus. Fly safely. Thank you. Thank you. While most aerial chases you'll see from a helicopter, we don't usually turn the cameras in. So we've developed these rigs over the last couple of months where we can basically hard mount cameras to show that Ethan Hunt is flying the helicopter without anybody else. Every camera position has been designed so that you can see that Tom is doing everything himself. It's super important for a movie like Mission to be doing it all practically and for real. Tom doesn't want to sit in the green screen. The audiences can tell when something's been cheated. First time we're doing it, it's going to work our way in. For safety, all the pilots get together in the morning and they discuss very clearly where they're going to be and what their positions are for every shot. I'm going to look down and I'll take it over the waterfalls. I enter it right away. Let's okay. go. I got friends. Head to helicopter. The most dangerous part of the aerial sequence is really that there's more than one helicopter in the air. We have 13 helicopters in the production. The ones on camera are doing aerobatics just a few feet from each other. It's pretty wild. I have you inside throughout the entire sequence. They all have to maintain visual contact. And then there's Tom. He's the pilot. He's acting. And he's the camera operator. We're all just ready when you are, Tom. Copy that. The scariest part was the 360 downward spiral. Most pilots wouldn't attempt this. The corkscrew turn is very challenging for a pilot. We're going to break to the left. It takes a lot of skill and a lot of practice. We're good, we're rolling. You make a mistake, somebody's going to die from it. I'm going to go. And each spiral looks like he's going to crash. Oh God. Hit, 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 hit. Boo. That's what I want. How was that, McHugh? Uh, very upsetting here. Well, I guess that's a trend. Absolutely. Your mission. Should you choose to accept it? I wonder, did you ever choose not to? The end you always feared is coming. And the blood will be on your hands. The fallout of all your good intentions. You had a terrible choice to make in Berlin. One life over millions. And now the world is at risk. This is the CIA's mission. If he had held on to the plutonium, we wouldn't be having this conversation. His team would be dead. Yes, they would. That's the job. You don't understand what you're involved in. You need to walk away. Please don't make me go through you. How many times has Hunt's government betrayed him, disavowed him, cast him aside? How long before a man like that has had enough? Ethan, that's not who we are. Maybe we need to reconsider that. So, how is he? Oh, you know, same old Ethan. I find it best not to look. <laughs>